nature manifests itself in myriad ways and countless forms. All existing in intricate yet fragile balance. But we humans are experts at manipulating things, however so intricate or fragile to our advantage. Up to a hundred thousand species are going extinct each year due to different human interventions, tough and sturdy as they may look. They are thriving on a delicate balance. Residents of the world's toughest terrains, the Himalayan ibex is the key species of Punjab National Park, a transboundary national park on the border of Pakistan and China. There are 22 national parks in Pakistan ranging from the north to the south. But Khunjrab is the highest national park of the world and hosts most beautiful, unique and majestic species of the world. Khunjrab National Park Dunya ka sabse unche uh, uh, national Park है यह इस National Park को बनाने का मकसद यहां पर एक दुनिया की रेर स्पीशीज मार्को पोलो शीप की वजह से यह इस्टेब्लिश हुआ Animals here can roam freely across the border because they don't need a visa or have any barriers Yak, with its woolly cloak, is the Buddha of the Khunjrab National Park. Meditating here and there, in between their grazing sessions, they are solitary creatures. Once threatened, but now protected, the ibex scales the rugged peaks of the Karakuram with unmatched mastery and skill. This introspection against the backdrop of the silver sky is perhaps to ponder the question of existence or maybe to cherish the moment of peace. But the sound of the gunshot sets the whole herd in commotion, everyone running for their dear life but one, the one that wasn't lucky enough and finds the dust writhing and squirming, murdered in cold blood. There is no pleasure in killing, but for some, it is. खैबर के बासियों ने महसूस किया कि इंडिविजुअल जाके जो शिकार करके गोश्त खाते हैं उससे फायदा चंद ग्रानुं को मिलता है बजाय इसके कि हम इन जंगली हायात को बचाएंगे जो कंजर्वेशन के लॉस के मुताबिक तो उससे जब ट्रॉफी हंटिंग शुरू होगी तो एक इनकम जर्नेट होगी जिससे गांव के हर हाउसहोल्ड को फायदा मिलेगा जिससे एजुकेशनल डेवलपमेंट आएगी दूसरा प्रोफेशनल डेवलपमेंट से हां शुरू हो जाएंगे 
Winter in Punjab and the surrounding villages is harsh and unforgiving for the animals and humans alike. So much so, the streams forget to move an inch. Bibi Miraj is the resident of the village Khaibar. One of her prime duties is to feed her family, which is not an easy task, especially in winters, with no means of earning. People in the surrounding villages of Khunjrab mostly depend upon subsistence farming or livestock rearing. Shabir Beg is a range officer here at the Khunjrab National Park. He issues the hunt permits and the entry tickets to the visitors. A team of hunters from Sindh is seeking a permit for the trophy hunting. This would cost them around 350,000 Pakistani rupees for one trophy. The permit government gives the permit for the permit. हंटर आता है उसको हम या ब्लू शिप या आईबेक्स उनके ट्रॉफी हंटिंग कराते हैं उसका प्रोसीजर ये होता है कि परमिट का जो सीजन है वो फर्स्ट अक्टूबर से स्टार्ट होता है और जाके टिल थर्टीएथ अप्रैल में एंड होता है ये जो पूरा सीजन है इसमें हम ट्रॉफी हंटिंग कराते हैं द रूल ऑफ द गेम is that the park ranger would take them to a specified location where they can shoot the oldest ibex. Ranger can tell which one among the herd is the oldest one from the length of their horns. Hunters are confident that they could make a kill and it seems that everything favors the hunters and this poor creature is oblivious that death is lurking nearby. Yet again, the sound of the gunshot sets the herd in panic, except one who is stunned. And those blue eyes become white with shock and disbelief and yet another victim of technology. Technology to kill with perfection. Trophy hunters have their kill. The community would receive their share. Kumshkor shkisare nja pesash sa kruizit, sa kësho lonin gryunden, kje huzman vëshka gjojve një ofis randen, u është e taj më rjunden një është ta randen. The harsh weather has little or no offering for someone. Snow leopards are among the rarest species of Kunjrab National Park. This one has descended too low near the human settlement in search of food. 
They are sly creatures and masters of stealth. They hunt by ambush and usually devour on the weakest ibex. Usually ill or too old, but since we have killed the old ones, so in search of food he lands in trouble.